they came and said, hey, you know, we know that you're doing a lot of stuff in the school working with working with dads clubs and working with a lot of different programs that are helping dads to become engaged in the schools and we want to try to get young urban families engaged into the school so we want to pick your brain and find out what can we do to try to do that and I said the dads In 2014, in a suburb outside of Dallas, times were changing. Urban sprawl dictated that the small town of Cedar Hill had to expand. And with that expansion came the potential for the demise of the town as their citizens knew it. That was one perspective, but Cedar Hill decided to view it differently. They chose to take control of the rapid growth by engaging the help of an army of powerful people, the Cedar Hill Dad and new superintendent Orlando Riddick embraced an opportunity. You know, walking into the district, um, I saw that immediately uh, there had to be a partnership in getting a lift to the work that we were going to do. And that partnership didn't only entail um, internal partners, meaning how were teachers and administrators and central office going to work through this world, um, the partnership within the city, and how were we going to partner with the city of City Hill, but how are we really going to partner with our parents uh, through the work? There had been an environment for, um, for a minute that um, was not inclusive. Um, and I think as that environment uh, began to occur, it became stronger and stronger. Uh, the communication and the ability to want to bring parents inside was not uh, part of the welcoming environment that our schools had. As we were looking for a structured way to get our dads engaged, um, we did some research with um, Chris Will from Oak Cliff Bible Fellowship. And as we were exploring some of our options, um, we came across All Pro Dads and Watchdogs. And we were trying to determine which one would be a better fit for us. Um, the thing that stood out for us was that All Pro Dads was faith-centered and that it also encouraged family and that connection with your children. It seemed to be very deliberate that they wanted the dads to connect with the students, not just stop by, not just wave, not just say you were here, but to have a long-lasting effect in the family. And once you strengthen those family relationships, then we start to see things change at home, which in turn help us at school. And I said, what about you coming into the schools and being involved during the school day? What would that look like? And so I think some dads thought we were talking about teaching. I said, no, not necessarily teaching, you know. What about just being present, you know, being inside of the cafeteria, being in the hallways, being at the doors when the kids get out of the bus or get off the bus or get out of the cars and welcoming them, greeting them. It started as a small group. But very quickly, All Pro Dad caught on and became a mighty game changer in Cedar Hill. And so on that first meeting, we had four dads uh, to attend the first meeting. The second meeting, we had about 30. That's when I joined. The third meeting, we had about 80 dads. The fourth meeting, we were at 120 dads. And today, a year or so later, we are over 1,000 dads, closer to 1,100 dads. So our dads have supported us every day, going on now two years. They come and they greet our students, they open the doors for them, they say kind things to them, they give them high fives, they tell them to have a great academic day. They also mentor our students, they read to our students, they tutor our students, they come in and they do cafeteria duty. The All Pro Dad program was embraced by the parents, every one of the 13 schools in Cedar Hill, along with churches, government, businesses, and the entire community. I've been in Cedar Hill for eight years, and the implementation of the All Pro Dads has completely changed the culture. So it kind of holds everybody to a higher level of a standard of excellence, and our students are rising to that, and they're serving as fantastic role models. And that's really what this is all about, us collaborating, All Pro Dads, PTA, working together to make a real big impact on our, and a difference in our schools. And that's, that's really what it's all about. 
It's as though Cedar Hill was waiting for this spiritual and community connection. And the all-pro dads are the answer to making a visible difference. I told the rest of the guys, say, go grab a classroom. You know, there's some other kids that don't have dads here. So we probably had maybe, what, about an extra 100 kids that were not a part of us, but we just brought them all in and had breakfast with them as well. And some of the kids are asking, hey, why did you guys bring us in? We want you to be a part of this. We don't want to exclude you, you guys at all. We want you to be a part of our pro dads. We are here for you. So anything that you need, anyone you need to talk to, you can always come to us. And the culture throughout the whole district has changed as a result of them being being so present all the time. I mean, no matter if we're having a dance, um, volleyball, softball, baseball game, a one-act play, we call them, they're there. You know, with the development of the All-Pro Dads here, we got a phenomenal uh, parent engagement um, that helps us quite a bit. Use them here at football events, basketball events we use them at, uh, our parades, they go with us on our parades. So. They're a real big positive impact on our community. What a difference a year makes. Today, there's a spirit of hope, engagement, and stewardship in Cedar Hill, something sorely missing in our society overall. Now imagine if this Cedar Hill spirit expanded beyond Texas. Just imagine hundreds of Cedar Hills across the country. It is beyond worth the effort, just what we've seen and what our dads have been able to accomplish. It truly has transformed our district and our community. And I think the next step for all pro dads really is getting past the welcome part. Hey, you're welcome to be in this environment to participate in the education of your children. Uh, but now it becomes more of an expectation. We had 173 dads come out for all pro dads day. It was amazing, it was standing room only. And so that was just the first year. This year, I can't wait to see what we're going to do and how they're going to show up and show out. All A's today, okay? All A's today. You got it? All right, all A's.